Welcome to Saguaro National Park, a magical desert wonderland where giant cacti rule the land and adventure waits around every corner. Everyone, my name is Chang Fan An. Have you ever seen a cactus that's as tall as a building? Today, I'm at Saguaro National Park. Let's go in and check out some of the tallest cactuses on Earth. Saguaro National Park is located in the sunny state of Arizona in the southwestern United States. It's named after the saguaro cactus, a symbol of the American West and a true icon of the desert. Spanning over 91,000 acres, the park is divided into two distinct districts. The Rincon Mountain District to the east and the Tucson Mountain District to the west, each offering its own unique landscape and experiences. The Rincon Mountain District has taller mountains, lush forests, and cooler temperatures. You can explore shady trails, discover hidden waterfalls, and learn all about the plants and animals that live in the mountains. Meanwhile, the Tucson Mountain District has lots of tall saguaro cacti, rugged mountains, and beautiful desert scenery. It's a great place for hiking, picnicking, and spotting wildlife like birds or lizards. This time we chose to visit the Tucson Mountain District to the west. Named after the iconic saguaro cactus, Saguaro National Park was established in 1994 to protect and preserve this majestic symbol of the American Southwest. But the history of this land stretches far back beyond its designation as a national park. A long time ago, before there were any people here, the land where Saguaro National Park sits was home to Native American tribes like the Tohono O'odham and the Hohokam. They lived off the land, hunting, gathering food, and respecting the plants and animals that called this place home. Fast forward to more recent times, when settlers began to move into this area. They were amazed by the towering saguaro cacti and the beauty of the desert landscape. But as more people arrived, they started building houses, roads, and farms, and the desert began to change. In the early 20th century, people realized that they needed to protect this special place for future generations to enjoy. That's when Saguaro National Monument was created in 1933 to preserve the saguaro cacti in the desert ecosystem. Then, in 1994, Saguaro National Monument became Saguaro National Park, with two separate districts, the Tucson Mountain District and the Rincon Mountain District. Let's talk about our star of the show, the saguaro cactus. Did you know that saguaros can live for over 200 years? That's right. These magnificent cacti have been standing tall in the desert for longer than many of us can imagine. And can you believe that some saguaros can grow as tall as a five-story building? That's taller than most of the trees in the forest. But did you know that these mighty giants start their lives as tiny seeds, no bigger than the tip of your finger? It's true. Sagrado cacti began their journey as tiny seeds, which is often spread by birds and animals across the desert landscape. 
As the saguaro cactus grows, it starts to develop its iconic shape, with tall stems and arms reaching towards the sky. It's a slow process, with some saguaro cacti taking up to 75 years to grow their first arm. Some saguaros have just one arm, while others have multiple arms reaching out in every direction, like a giant green octopus waving hello to the sky. These arms help the saguaros soak up as much sunlight as possible and store precious water for times of drought. Look closely and you'll see that saguaro wears a suit of armor made of tough, waxy skin and sharp spines. These spines help protect the cactus from animals looking for a drink hot from the scorching desert sun. So Grow Cactus isn't just a home for itself, it's also a sanctuary for a wide variety of desert wildlife. Birds nest in its arms, bats roost in its hollows, and small animals seek shelter in its shade. In the Sograo National Park, you can see lots of species of cacti up close, except for the jumping chala. You should admire it from a safe distance and avoid touching it to prevent any unexpected surprises. Imagine a cactus. It's tall, green, and covered in spines, right? Well, the jumping chala is a type of cactus that likes to take things to a whole new level. Its spines are not just ordinary spines, they're like tiny hooks. Now here's what gets interesting. If you get too close to a jumping chala, these spines can easily attach themselves to you, just like if they were jumping off the plant. That's how it got its name, because it feels like the cactus is jumping onto you. But don't worry, it's not really jumping. What's happening is that the spines are very loosely attached to the plant, so they easily detach and cling to anything that brushes against them. It's a clever way for the cactus to protect itself from animals that might want to eat it. So if you're ever out exploring in the desert and you see a jumping chala, make sure to admire it from a safe distance. You don't want to end up with a bunch of prickly hitchhikers. So Grow National Park offers numerous trails of different lengths and difficulty levels allowing visitors to explore the park's diverse landscapes and encounter iconic saguaro cacti up close. The trail that we are visiting is Valley View Trail. Valley View is less than one mile round trip and it lets you get up close to massive saguaros and introduces you to the park's landscape and ecology. The trail ends at the viewpoint that overlooks a field of saguaro and it's one of the best places in the park for a sunset. It's a nice family-friendly hike in the national park. Saguaro National Park offers endless opportunities for adventure and exploration. Whether you're hiking through rugged desert terrain, camping under the stars, or learning about the rich history and culture of the area, there's something for everyone to enjoy. So pack your bags, grab your sunscreen, and get ready for the adventure of a lifetime at Saguaro National Park. Come explore, 
Discover and make memories that will last a lifetime in this extraordinary desert oasis.